What did you want to talk about? <sighs> what are you doing here? Oh. Are you okay? Did you drink too much last night? You called me over, and you don't even remember. Huh? No way. Uh, I mean, yesterday, I... <sighs> What's wrong? You're acting weird. Weird? Me? God, why can't I remember the time I spend with you? It's like the important parts are missing. Oh, I remember them, though. <laughs> oh, well, I wonder why I... <laughs> Silly. Annoying. Huh? You think? My head hurts just listening to it. Hmm? What's this long hair? <sighs> That's Catherine's. What should I do? Should I just tell her? No. I can't let her find out like this. Oh, that's mine. Probably off my chest. <laughs> you know, manly. Huh? Your chest? <laughs> really? Yeah, yeah, y you know, uh, it's it's that... But you know when sometimes a long white hair grows on your body, it, it's good luck? But this is like, really long. Yeah, I was growing it out. It just fell out by itself. <laughs> good thing, too. It's bad luck if you pull it out yourself, you know? Oh, really? It's not from another girl, is it, Vincent? No, why, why would you say that? You know, because if it is, I'm going to die right here. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Knock it off with all the dying stuff, okay? Then I'll kill you. <laughs> I die, or I kill you. Which would be better? Take. Come on, come on, whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah! Fine. I'll give you five seconds. If you don't answer me, I'll kill you. One, two, huh? three, four. Hey, come on, come on. Quit fooling around. Five. There's no other girl. Right, you're imagining things. Hmm, is that the truth? Of course it is. Hmm... <laughs> okay, I trust you. Thanks. <sighs> God, she's scary like this. Is she gonna pull a knife on me one day or something? Oh, no, there is no one day. I've got to do something about this relationship. I'm not going to ask you about the past. It doesn't matter. But from now on, if you ever cheat on me, I'll be angry. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> ah, to get that, do you? Whoa, 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 wait, hold on. <gasps> no. huh? Hey! <laughs> what the heck? Why is this locked? Unchain this door! Uh Sure, but uh, hold on a second. <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> it is my landlady. <laughs> she was trying to open the door. <laughs> hmm? The landlady? Yeah, I forgot to pay my rent last month. <laughs> you know how it is with money. <laughs> you gotta be kidding. 
I'm gonna use the bathroom. <sighs> what the hell, Vincent? What is this? Will you keep it down? Huh? One of my bosses is here. Huh? Really? Not the best time for you to be. Maybe I should at least say hello. He gets real grumpy if you wake him up. He's sleeping in the back. Well, if you really think it would... <laughs> He's awake? Yeah, hurry up! Now hey! try! Go, 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 go. Uh, uh... Sorry. I'm really sorry. I just wanted to protect you from the smell. Huh? He really smells, you know, and, and he was drinking last night. Oh, really? Yeah, I'm glad I got you out in time. Whew. Hey, we're not that close, but he kind of forced his way in while he was drunk. Oh, well, he is your boss, huh? Yeah, he is. You just seemed really stressed, so I came to see how you were doing. Well, thank you. Uh, come by after work and I'll complain some more. <laughs> oh, I got you something from the new shop that opened up. Oh, uh, yeah? Here. I'll see you later. Owen, I am pregnant. <laughs> I just wanted you to know. Seriously? Was that why you really came here? I need to make up my mind quick. You don't know how that makes me feel. Seriously. See ya. Oh, uh, she moved in recently. She works at the bar with Erica. Plays the piano. Oh, isn't she cute? Oh, uh, well, uh, bye. <sighs> we still need to meet my parents and tell them. Oh, and we have to pick a name, but that might be rushing things. I'll text you the details later. I gotta go. <sighs> Meeting the parents. Am I just gonna sit here and let this happen? Hmm? You got a mail. Oh. God, look at her. Oh, man, you look at those. What am I doing? I can't look away. No, no, I've made up my mind. I can't let her tempt me. Shit, if she finds out, I am screwed. I gotta do something quick. No time to think about the future. Still. Mm. Is this girl? You're late. Did you see the movie where the guy was, uh, you know... Shut up, asshole! And just give me some toilet paper, please! Well, quit mumbling. I can't concentrate in here. Still, this girl... But, girl? Hey, what are you looking at in there? I wanna see? What am I thinking? This can't go on any longer. I have to tell her to stop. Dude, do not delete that picture. So, uh, you still doing the two-timing tango? Yeah, don't say it like that. It wasn't on purpose. Well, if she is pregnant, you gotta bite the bullet. <laughs> yeah, you're only saying that because it's not you. Hey man, variety is the spice of life. You need to enjoy it more. Just like the wasabi-coated sushi they serve here. You know what I'm saying, bro? You suck at metaphors. What I'm saying is, you've got options ahead of you. Well, yeah. Maybe Catherine would be happier as a single mom than she would be with you. What are you, drunk? 
No, she wouldn't want that. Well, what exactly do you want here? <sighs> my mind and my heart don't exactly agree on that. Uh-huh. Well, you've got to be even more careful. If you're caught, you can't call it an accident anymore. I know. I know. Accidents, huh? More and more of them lately. The old guy next door to me kicked the bucket. I heard shocking, huh? Thought he always did like to party. Probably party too hard. He had this horrible look on his face. Really? It's like that stuff on the news. <sighs> anyway, have some Magaro. It's supposed to be good for your circulation. Huh? You're as pale as a ghost, man. Oh. You going to the bar tonight? Uh, maybe. You? Nah, I have to pass today. Got overtime. But I guess all you can do is drink and forget, huh? <laughs> Pretty much. Enough with the shitty piano! Uh, uh, you're making my ears bleed. Oh, why don't you come play with me instead? Sorry, I'm in the middle of a performance. Huh? You gonna talk back to me too? All you bitches need to shut up and do what I say. Excuse me, but are you in charge of how other people live their lives? <sighs> What's your problem? You fucking... Hey, would you give it a rest? I don't know what you're going through, but don't take it out on her. Besides, trying to make other people change is pointless. I mean, I'm not one to talk. But I'm telling you, if you want your life to improve, then it's up to you to... Was he even listening? <sighs> Anyway, you okay, Rin? Yeah, thank you. Don't waste your breath on guys like him. Man, you say some thought-provoking stuff. It's like you got a whole nother perspective. Philosophically, I mean. Really? I think you're pretty amazing yourself. You always lift people up when they're down. <laughs> Do I? I mean, I've given people a lot of things to complain about. And you know... Hearing that from you makes me kind of feel like... <sighs> what the... Did we meet somewhere else? Ugh, damn it. Just confusing myself. Huh? Vincent, I'll be waiting for you. Don't forget, okay? Uh, yeah. Sure, I'll be here again tomorrow. <sighs> you got a mail. This in public? I need to check this out somewhere where no one can see. Ugh, why do I keep cheating? Why can't I just tell her I have a girlfriend? I tried to stay cool in front of Rin, but I really need to get my act together. Ah. 
I know this is subtle, but here is some trivia for you, as you seem to have finished the class. Have you ever heard of hot buttered rum? It's a cocktail that combines rum with hot water, sugar, and butter. I know what you're thinking, rum and butter? But the two actually pair quite well. The drink's sweet scent is perfect on a cold day. That was the cocktail trivia for tonight. Empty already? Hey, can I get a drink? What would you like to order? I need a beer. I've got it perfectly memorized. Please enjoy your time here. Would you like to speak to Lindsay? Would you like to speak to Martha? I received a text from Lindsay. I received a text from Martha. Do you believe the rumor about the text that grants wishes? This one? I don't think Mr. Todd would say that. I hear Mr. Todd's body is heavily scarred. I hear Mr. Todd was hit by an axe. He doesn't want to show those scars to his wife. I hear Mr. Archie has many new wounds. He gets new ones every time he sleeps with a woman. I don't think he can forgive himself. <sighs> it's four days until the time of freedom. What are you talking about? You got a mail. Mr. Morgan is dreamy today. Mr. Morgan looks the same as he did 20 years ago. A woman Mr. Morgan loved was killed. Mr. Morgan didn't follow her into death. I wonder if he will kill the murderer. even when I drink. I think these rumors gave me a terrible nightmare last night. These rumors are about cheating men, right? Gotta say, I, I'm a little scared. You have a reason to be scared then? I'm a piece of trash. If they're cursing cheaters to death, I'd be the first to go. Trash? I killed my wife. What? That's the other case I told you I'm investigating from six years ago. You killed your wife? And you're still researching the case. I'm trash. Huh. Oh, it's Catherine. Hello? Hey, what's up? Well, um... Oh, yeah. Have you eaten the cake I brought you? Oh, sorry. Not yet. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Catherine? Vincent? Have you been busy recently, or do you have something bothering you? Why do you ask? I mean, you seem to have been thinking about something for the past few days. Well, I can tell. Oh, well... I'm sorry. I'll call you later. Bye. Sorry, I don't have any information about that incident. I'll be on the job today, though, so hopefully I'll have something for you. You got a mail.
I started to think about our high school days after what happened to Paul. Oh boy, Paul loved the girls back then too. You and Orlando were always doing stupid things. Didn't you guys once eat Catherine's lunch and get chewed out for it? Did we? I know she was mad, but she started bringing you snacks once in a while. Remember? I thought she just wasn't hungry. Yeah, dumbass. There was so much going on back then. We were all busy with our own problems. It wasn't all fun, but I felt more alive. More than I do now. It's with you all of a sudden. Is something bothering you? No. <sighs> hey, really, what's, what's going on? I'm just reminiscing. I'm gonna have another drink. If you're going home, be careful. Sure. I've got a confession to make. I'm really only an ex-journalist. Oh, so you quit? I still do research, but I've stopped the whole writing part. Okay, but why? Long ago, I covered a story on a young girl, a ballerina, very talented. Lots of people were sure she'd make it big. I wrote an article about her because her story touched me. She was poor and had to take several part-time jobs while studying ballet. The article was a hit, and her popularity soared. It's the truth. Wow, it's really something. But at the same time, she suddenly had a lot of enemies. They must have been rivals, jealous of her newfound fame. After all the harassment, her family. What? I'm sorry, I'll tell the rest some other time. I don't think I've had enough to drink today. Go easy on the booze, okay? You got a mail. Drink and drink, but I can't get drunk. Oh, oh shit. It's from her. Oh, sorry. But, well, whatever. speak alone with you. I can't believe you don't remember me. And all this time, I was striving to one-up you. One-up? What? I can change the markets with a nod of my head. I've got friends in every branch of government you can think of. I've done a complete 180 from when I was in grade school. So why do I feel so powerless? not like that. Maybe it wasn't to you, but I've been trying to surpass you all along. What? I don't think I'm that great of a person. In the end, there's not a single thing that I'm better at than you. I can't make the one person that I love happy. Oh, Anna, was it? Out of everything in my life, she's the one thing I ever chose for myself. But I have another fiance. Uh, I don't know what to say. I don't need your pity. Not wrong. Hey. Hey. Are you alone today? Hey, uh, do I look like a good person? Yeah? Y you're not a good judge of character, are you? I'm one of the worst people ever. Huh? I sleep with lots of women, take their money, and run. Lather, rinse, repeat. Why? I don't like women. They disgust me. <sighs> what about you? Are you usually loyal to them? Well, I, I guess. I mean, I've been dating my girlfriend for a while now. So you mean you'd pull back even if the woman of your dreams hit on you? I don't know. Women don't stay true either. A happy family is just an illusion. Mothers and sons are just women and men when it comes down to it. Huh? Just kidding. 
I'm going now. I only came to have one drink. You got a mail. Is that Rapunzel game any good? I tried it because Todd, my boss, was into it. It's a lot of pushing and pulling, just like relationships with women. Nothing but trouble. My head hurts. See ya. Uh, well, 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 shucks. shucks. It's, it's late. late. I'm tired, tired today. I should go home and get some rest. I'm getting tired of waiting. <laughs> I wonder if you'll have a helping hand again tonight. Did I, did I just hear something? Vincent, that woman you were with this morning, was she your girlfriend? Sorry, that must have been a shock, but yeah, her name's Catherine, almost like yours. Really? What a coincidence. Yeah, you're telling me. I only saw her for a second, but she looked beautiful. Erica was just telling me that couples in a relationship hold their significant others dear to them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they definitely should, shouldn't they? Hmm. So what's up? Something on your mind? It's about my piano playing. There's... there's something missing. Really? I think you're doing pretty good. I think I'm close. If I can find out what I'm missing, then maybe... for helping Rin earlier. That guy's just having trouble with his wife. Oh, so that's what's going on. He's not a bad person, really. If he acts up again, I'll take care of it. I've been getting the feeling like people keep staring at me. Maybe I'm showing a little too much cleavage. It's just you. Hey, don't shoot me down just like that with three words. Come on, I know you sneak a peek at me every so often. No, I don't. Three words again? A lot of customers have been asking about Rin lately. Really? Why now? I guess those rumors about a mysterious piano player are getting around. Rin's pretty cute and definitely getting better at piano. Who knows? Maybe it's the start of something big. Then I could quit working here and become Rin's manager. <laughs> In your dreams. tired. I haven't been able to sleep lately. I tried staying in my girlfriend's place, but that makes me even more tired. Your girlfriend, huh? What's she like? <laughs> what? You, you want to know? You never talk about her. Toby was wondering too. There's nothing to talk about. Maybe later. Hmm? I'm gonna have another drink. If you're going home, be careful. Yeah. The news. It's all about the recent chain of deaths. Just between you and me, it seems an acquaintance of one of our customers has passed away. It's just a coincidence. Well, I don't believe in curses either. But to incur the grudge of a female is a horrifying thing. You see, my wife left me. When she was away on vacation, I brought a young lady home and was just having a little fun. And then, she comes home all of a sudden. After that, she's swinging all kinds of improvised weaponry at me. Phew, what a night. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, but still, I love my wife even now. She's a classy lady. Hmm. Then maybe there's no reason for you to worry about the curse. I mean, if cheating is the cause of the curse, everything's already been taken care of, right? I see. You're right. Maybe that's why I don't have strange nightmares? Besides, it's just a rumor anyway. It's stupid. Well, 
The news will just move on once they figure out what's causing this. Perhaps the nightmares are being caused by a lack of sleep. But even so, how could so many people be experiencing the same thing? In times like this, having a little chat with Rin may help you to de-stress. Although, I must say there's something about the way she plays that I just can't get used to. This is our latest in the coverage of the mysterious weakening death epidemic. Matthew Miller was found dead today. We retraced his footsteps from the day before as part of our investigation. This epidemic, a horrible mess. According to his mother, who spoke with him on the phone, after that point, he'd been plagued with nightmares. Quadrangle. You'll be frozen with fear. This voice. Huh? Mm. Oh, I can't, I can't turn, turn back, back now. now. I can't I let her find out. out. Pregnant. She's pregnant, and here I am cheating for a third time. What am I doing? I know this is sudden, but here is some trivia about beer, now that you've emptied your pint glass. There are two types of beer yeast. The first is ale yeast, the top fermenting type. The second is lager yeast. The bottom for me. Lager is produced by most major brands and is best enjoyed ice cold. Most fruity craft and Belgium beers are ales. It's more fun to choose between the two when you know the differences between them. And that was the beer trivia for the night. Empty already? You still want a drink? No, I'm cool. You don't look so hot. You should go home and get some rest. I know. Oh, yeah, about my bill. Uh... Yeah, put it on your tab, right? I know, I know. Anyway, just make sure you get home safely, okay? With all the rumors and bad news going around. Ah, you worry too much, Erica. I'll be fine. See you soon.
Stepping on an ice block will make you slide until you reach the edge. It's a dangerous hazard that can lead to instant death. Be careful. Snow? Shit, it's cold. I, I'm gonna freeze to death! Edge. Undo. <sighs> Having some trouble? Remember, you can always go back and undo it. here.
I'll take this. All right, I, all right, I got it. How's this? Edge. I made it! Here I go. Another guy who always supported her? I haven't seen him today. <laughs> if women weren't around, men would live like gods. And wherever women end, foolish men are born. I won't return to that reality. <laughs> hey, what's the matter with you? Get a hold of yourself. I won't return to that reality. Booth told me that my living would deny somebody else of a future. So, what's my sin? What did I do and when? I don't know. Actually, it'd be kind of creepy if I did know, wouldn't it? Uh, I don't get this. I'm going crazy. Uh, I don't get this. I'm going crazy. Uh, but all of them only think of saving themselves. They're only friendly on the outside. They're hypocrites. Just like the people who surround me every day, I won't join them. I don't need their help to climb some blocks. Uh, I just thought of a technique. I didn't ask you to teach me anything. I'm just talking out loud. Allow me to explain ice evasion. If you want to move around ice stones without slipping, hang. As long as you're hanging off the side, you won't have to worry about slipping. That's amazing. I won't thank you. As I said, I'm just talking to myself. <laughs> what kind of mountain will I be forced to climb next? I think the technique went... A lot of want to move around ice stones you. As without I slipping. <laughs> hey. <sighs> what do you want to be reborn as? You die and it's over. Simple as that. But I have more important things to worry about right now. Like how I can get away from her. She? A girl. A former fan of mine. A fan? I used to be a singer in an indie band. A damn rich boy hit it big. And I was stuck being a plain old cook. That bitch walked away from me too. Now a monster that looks just like her keeps tormenting me. Asking why I gave up. But what was I supposed to do? Following your dreams is a luxury of the rich. Hmm. <sighs> I didn't have the cash. That's all there is to it. <sighs> Master Cruz, if you could be reborn, what would you want to return as? Huh? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe the son of a rich family. I see. Well, money can't buy happiness. I would like to be reborn as anything but a human. I want to live free from the shackles of money. I'm really looking forward to my next life. Hey, we're gonna make it out of here. It's too early to be thinking about reincarnation. Would you cry if I died? Hey, don't say that. Hmm. There are some things I need to think about. So, please go on ahead without me. All right. I'd better see you on the next floor. Go on without me, and don't worry. <sighs> I'm glad you're safe. I've been working hard this far, but maybe I'm nearing the end of my road. Come on, you're not done yet. You get the strength to be pessimistic. You can keep climbing. Wow. I always thought it. But you really are amazing. 
going around encouraging everyone, raising morale. It's truly something. The scenery sure has changed. Is this the fifth floor? It's getting more and more complex, though. I don't know if I can keep this up. If you're worried, I can tell you the techniques I've learned. <laughs> Thanks. You're a kind sheep. You're famous for being a great climber. I gotta keep up now. <sighs> Is this place hell? She did tell me to go to hell. Who? The chick I slept with the other day. My boss was saying that his girl is a witch, though. I should get going. Today's layout is nasty. It might be special techniques. Tell me something. Do you know of this technique? Allow me to explain ice pulling. If you're holding onto a block when you move onto an ice block, you won't go sliding off. But remember, you can't push while you're standing on an ice block. You can only pull. That's all I've got for right now, but feel free to talk to me anytime. It's really helpful. You're really thoughtful. You not only have skill, but spirit and tenacity as well. The weak cling to the strong. It raises their chances of survival, after all. Hmm. Well, let's both do our best. Do you want to review the techniques? I gotta go. Good luck to you guys. I'm glad you're safe. She's the witch. She wants revenge. I broke up with her because she lied about being pregnant. And now look at me. Why does dad come out every night? What's that? The big one. Every night, my dad comes after me. This is just your father, right? I mean, why is that scary? <sighs> Look, I'm gonna get out of this hellhole. Look, I'm gonna get out of this hellhole. Hey. Yo, speak of the devil. Huh? Some of the other guys were talking about a sheep that had been climbing really well. When you devise a new technique, teach us. We'll let you know what we've come up with, too. Let's work together and get out alive. You're a great climber. Teach us some of your moves when you have time. Rin, what's wrong? You don't look so good. I... I saw it happen. I saw someone fall. Someone who liked my music. I felt so helpless. Are there things I just have no control over? I'm scared. Thinking about you disappearing. Don't worry. I'll make it through, no matter what. Vincent, 